And here comes one of my favorites. The following contest is a championship tournament semi-finals match. Making his way to the ring from California, weighing in at 200 pounds, the Northern Classic Wrestling World Heavyweight Champion, Matthews Sanders. Matches of this caliber with this level of talent showing their skills, this is why I do what I do. Doesn't matter the situation, the champion always has a winning game plan. Yeah, now we're talking. And his opponent from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 218 pounds. The Superstar! It's all about showing off for this superstar. They are fearless and want everyone to know. <laughs> you say fearless, I say insane. Let's just call the whole thing off. He is in perhaps the best shape of his career, and he will need that with the competition level this high. And here we go in this tournament matchup. Who will move forward? Who will be erased off the bracket? Tournaments have a tendency of surprise results, so we'll see if this match continues that pattern. Who won the race? Charlie's horse. And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. Ooh, a sharp kick. Oh, solid contact there. Shifts it back onto him. Feels like in an Extreme Rules match, your strategy almost has to be to have no strategy. Well, you do need preparation. You have to accept that you're walking. And will this be it? Denying a two count there. A little closer to getting the pinfall there, but this is still anybody's fight. And he's taking this to the outside now. He's rummaging for some sort of equalizer underneath the ring. Whack! This is turning into Swanson Street. Hope you boys put your running shoes on. It might be time to clear out. Specifically targeting the leg. Targeting the leg, doing what they have to do to cut away at the base. Arm trapped. Endless knee strikes. Now he's been put on the defensive. Perhaps looking for some kind of equalizer here. He's got a sledgehammer, and you better believe his opponent's name 
is all over it. Man, each of these lethal maneuvers have got to be taking a toll. I don't care who you are. You can't take consecutive attacks like that without it affecting you. Well, great. Rearranging our ringside furniture here. Clear the announce desk. What a mess. Oh, catapulting down on the opponent. His shoulders are down. Gets his shoulder up before the two count. He's still in this. Uh-oh. Buries a knee to the body. Oh, uh, hold on. Is he thinking of the submission here? Oh, my God. Superhuman power. What are you doing? Some... Oh, a couple of knees there. That'll get him out of it. Hoist their opponent up on their shoulders. There's the opponent asleep. Gotta wonder if that keeps him down or fires him up. Two. And he's still in the game. The biggest weapon in his artillery fired back at him, but he survived it. And the heaviest hitter in the arsenal was flying. Diving foot stop. Brutal. He's absorbing some tough hits now. Well, we're deep into this tournament match. This is where things get serious. And he's able to counter. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. And he's taking on a persistent assault. Yeah, this can't be how he pictured this fight going. This is the only time anyone gets excited about garbage when a steel trash can gets involved with a fight. And gets tossed back into the mat. Oh, look at this. Float over neck breaker. Picture perfect. Elbow drop. Piercing. One's over. Oh, what a wind up. He skirts around it. Springboard close line. Big form. Hooked up. And DDT. Does he have him here? And our official is unable to get there and count this pin. Breaks the count. That is just pure instinct at this point. has not been tied to him. Stomping away, and then the knee right into the throat. Just ruthless. To the outside. This could get wild. Oh, risky business is afoot with the ladder in play now. Back in the ring now. The sound of this crowd is deafening, and he's asking for more. Look out! Oh, straight to the floor! Paying the price of treating your own body like a human crash test dummy. Don't do it! Somersault plancha to the floor! That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear, absolute reckless abandon. Oh, look at the start of this! Could be going into the playbook for submission! I'm oh, gonna take all the breath out of the body. Oh no, this is not where he That's it! Out. That's it! He's reaching under the ring for anything useful. He's looking at 
absolutely destroy his opponent with that chair. Oh, the chair. We got a cover. No, he gets the shoulder up. Almost inhuman at this point. Boom. It's okay. They weren't that pretty anyway. I've got to say, the amount of punishment we've seen in the match would have already ended most superstars. The level of resilience was... Look out! He paid for that one! Oh, man, big time. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Looking a little out of it, up on that turnbuckle. Oh, this... Fighting back. Pushing their opponent down. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. From the Kinshasa! Popped right in the face. Springboard clothesline! And there's the cover! It's over. Brutality finally comes to an end. Here is your winner, the Superstar! A statement victory by this guy tonight. The reward definitely seems greater than the risk right about now, but we'll see how they feel once they get back to the locker room and hit the showers.